um, when people learn to know you and um, they actually appreciate who you are and they find out afterwards where you come from or what my background is um, they don't judge because they already know the, the real me um, so that's what I tend to do today I never say hi I'm Beatrice I live in a castle or I grew up in a castle uh, usually it's uh, hi this is me my name is Beatrice uh, they get to know me and after that if they're lucky I'll tell them what my background is Well, I went to photo school when everybody else went to university. Um, but there at photo school, I met these two guys that I became really good friends with. Um, and after I'd known them for a while, I told them that I'd gone, gone to the boarding school uh, that I had gone to. They judged me uh, from, from when I told them uh, and had many opinions about that. But when I as I said, um, uh, told them that you know me now, and why judge me? Because people tend to be nice wherever they come from, or, or you don't have to be an asshole just because you go to boarding school or have the background that I am. Um, and they gave me, they, they said that I was right. And after that, we were good friends, and it took a few more years for me to actually tell them that this is where I come from. I actually invited them to a party here and, and that's when they found out because I didn't know how to tell them. Um, they have a totally different background from me. Uh, but nevertheless, two fantastic people who have actually taught me a lot. People have this idea that, well, people when I was younger had this idea that I was related to the king, which in fact I am not. That was nothing I really um, enjoyed hearing and nothing I took pride in, especially since I wasn't. Um, people have a tendency to think that it's very... Uh, uh, just because you live in a castle and you grew up in a castle, uh, people tend to think that you're ultra rich and have had a really easy childhood. And um, I had some real friends and then I had some real friends in school. Uh, the, some of the new friends uh, only had one mission was, which was to come with me home, see the castle and never be my friend again. Whereas I had some other friends who actually stayed with me uh, during the time I, I lived at home before I went to boarding school. Um, it's one of the oldest boarding schools in Sweden. It is the oldest boarding school in Sweden. Um, and I, find, I found my equals somehow. I went there for six years and, and um, because of I, me going there, it, it taught me um, that I didn't have to be ashamed where I came from. Uh, it took me a long time after boarding school to actually realize that um, depending on how you tell people about it or if you don't, um, people don't really care. Uh, and I have the most fantastic memories of my childhood. Uh, I've been very, very fortunate to have this background, uh, to grow up here and have some parents that have given me the, given me the freedom to actually play around and be everywhere and, 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 and use this to my um, advantage. Uh, which I am, in fact, very proud, proud of. But I think, I actually, the whole um, uh, coming to terms with my background was when I went to photo school uh, in Denmark. Uh, my first, uh, well, my, my year of photo school in Denmark, where I uh, finished off the, uh, the year with a session of photos with my family in the castle and outside the castle. Um, and my, uh, the photos um, were about my way of seeing uh, myself with my family and in, this, in these um, uh, surroundings. Um, Self-portraits again, <laughs> uh, in my underwear and all my family members dressed.